welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do all of my favorite Haitian stuff type of video. Songs, movie, food, drinks, etc. It is May, so it is Haitian Heritage Month. May 18th is Haitian Flag Day. I got my shirt over here saying, Wapcon George. <laughs> That's like one of my, me and my cousin's favorite phrase to say. So we got a shirt made out of saying, What conjoj? It's basically saying like, karma's a bitch. I'm not sure what conjoj exactly means. It's like, not something you could really translate. You get what's coming for you, basically. Or, if you go touch fire, you get burned. Something like that. So, it is Haitian Heritage Month. But all my fellow Haitians celebrating, we can't go to... Florida or anything like that to celebrate Haitian Flag Day because of quarantine so I decided to do a video of all my favorite Haitian stuff so growing up I was born in Haiti but I moved here when I was really young so growing up I didn't really do much like I didn't really listen to Haitian songs like that or watch Haitian movies or like I don't know I didn't really embrace the culture as much as I should have but now that I'm older, I just love being Haitian. Clearly, I have an accent, so you know I'm Haitian. But um, I just embrace it more nowadays. And I'm proud to say I'm Haitian. And um, so let's get to a few of my favorite things for being Haitian. Favorite Haitian food. I would have to say Dilikole avec legumes, which is basically red beans like rice rice and beans red beans with legume is basically like a vegetable mashed together kind of um plate so i love legume and du cole or du jonjon avec lambi i love that oh my god that's black rice with mushroom made with mushroom and lambi is conch it's like seafood i love it i love it these are my two favorite haitian food so these are my two favorite Haitian food. If you got that, I'm there, I'm eating. But you need to know how to cook it. You you don't eat this from any, even myself. I know the steps of how to cook it, but I've never tried cooking it because Haitian food takes so long to make and I just don't have the time for that. But I love Haitian food. Favorite drink, favorite drink, non-alcoholic. I love like fresh pressed juice, like Grenadilla, which is like passion fruit, I love it. But when my mom used to make carrot juice with um, orange, I like, love it. But favorite Haitian drink, I would say, is um, Kremas, which is made with coconut and um, Haitian rum and all the other extra stuff. It's like Coquito, but the Haitian one. Kremas is better than Coquito, okay? Favorite Haitian dessert, I love tablet. It's basically like nuts made with like sugar I love it and actually got some to show you guys this is really good it's like um can this focus yes this is like it's called tablet pistache so this one is made with um this one is made with peanut so it's really good that one is made with sesame brittles so it's basically like almost the same thing um Wowoli. So basically, I love tablet. It's like something you could snack on real quick. Tastes really good. So this is what it looks like. It's like sesame with like... I'm not sure what they make it out of, but... Mm. This is really good. And you don't necessarily have to go get this from Haiti. You could get this from Etsy. There's a company called Taste of Haiti where you could choose and pick all the Haitian desserts or you could just say you want all the Haitian snacks and stuff like that and they'll make you like a a box of all the Haitian snacks and this is really good. I haven't had this in a long time and I was just like, oh my God. I forgot how this tastes. And it's been the best thing ever. Favorite Haitian song. Right now, my favorite Haitian song is Criminel by Kai. Let me put a snippet for you guys. Oh. 
my buttons. <laughs> Okay, we're done. <laughs> One of my favorite songs, and I didn't even play my favorite part for you guys. Let me play my favorite part for you guys. So My favorite part. Okay, okay, I'm done. <laughs> Growing up, I didn't really listen to too much Haitian music because I honestly didn't know how to keep up. Like, I didn't follow any of the artists on Instagram or anything like that, so I didn't know when there was a new song. So all the Haitian songs that I knew were like really old, old songs from like 1990s or early 2000s or whatever. So, but like now, like when I got older, like in my 20s, I'm like all Haitian. Listen to Haitian music. I follow the Haitian artists on Instagram. I kind of relatively can keep up with the new artists and new songs when they come out and um, trying my best. All right. Living my best Haitian life. All right. Favorite Haitian group. I would say Kali Me. I really love their old, old album. <laughs> And now I like Kai. I like Kai a lot. Um, favorite Haitian movie. I love you, An. I don't really watch too many Haitian movies to be honest, but I love you, An is like a staple. Like my grandma will watch I love you, An, a thousand times a day. Like she knows everything. Like she knows the dialogue. She knows. Toto Bisha is everybody's favorite, so I love that movie. I love you, Ann, because I honestly don't watch too many Haitian movies, so I can't really be too picky with that one. So between Zouk and Kompa, I would rather Kompa only because Zouk is very sensual. Like, it's just like, kole kole ploge. I don't do that. That's too much. Haitian men, when they dance with you with Zouk, and you like, ploge, ploge, they like, pressing on you. I... Um, I don't like that, especially that my man is not Haitian and it is uncomfortable to be close, dancing so close to somebody and they be getting out of hand and I'd be like, oh no, no sir, no thanks. So I'd rather compa, compa is more like, more relaxed than Zouk, Zouk is very sexual, so I'd rather compa over Zouk. Okay, so that would die or more like carnival music, like festival music. I'd rather, I think you could play that would die at carnival, actually. But like I'm like a new fan of Labo Dai. I love it. I just be listening to like the craziest, like nasty shit and stuff. So I love Labo Dai now. And um, one of the my favorite song for Labo Dai is um, Tremble. I think that's Labo Dai. Favorite Haitian spot. Favorite Haitian spot in New York is definitely this place called Catra. It's it's um in Manhattan. And they do like Compa Tuesdays, and I love it because first off, there's free thai. There's not many places that have free ties around here, so I mostly go for the food. <laughs> but then they have a lounge, and it's really nice. You could just literally just go hang out by the bar, or you just eat and listen to music, watch people dance, and all that. So I told you guys my favorite food, favorite dessert, favorite drink, favorite singer, favorite um. My favorite song right now, my favorite movie. Um, what else? I think that's it. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching. That is it for all my favorite Haitian things. And this is again for Haitian Heritage Month since we don't get to celebrate Haitian Flag Day like we usually would with the whole week of, you know, celebrating. So this is my way of you know honoring my haitian heritage you know doing a video for all my favorite haitian stuff so